Mr. Stanley27 here bringing you some Battlefield 3 today. And if you've been paying attention to my last few videos, you may have noticed that your ears have been slowly molested by the awesomeness that is actually my new intro and outro music. So the new music is actually from a band I know in real life. A good friend of mine is the guitarist in the band, and they are the Sheepish Wolves. There will be a link in the description and something, an annotation on the video somewhere to go and check them out. I highly recommend it. As you can see, or as you can hear, they are absolutely awesome. But going back to the gameplay that we're actually looking at, this is probably one of the quickest games of Rush that I think I've ever played in Battlefield 3. The whole game, as you can probably see by the length of the video, lasted only about 5 minutes, which is pretty quick, seeing as generally you go into like a game of Rush like, oh, 8 to 10 minutes, it's a pretty quick game, but in 5 minutes, that is ridiculously quick, and that pretty much happened because the opposition weren't actually giving us any competition whatsoever. There was none of them in sight for like the next two objectives and I only die once because they just don't seem to be around. I only get, you can see by my score, I only get nine kills because I just don't see any of them. Right here you notice normally the boats are pretty hard one to swarm because you have people shooting down on you, they've got the upper ground, they've got a better, like, they've got the height advantage and it's pretty damn hard to actually attack this boat if you're playing against a well-constructed oppositional defending team but as you can see absolutely nobody in sight you can see a few people on the minimap but we've, our team's already got both objectives armed A is about to explode and B is basically about to explode as well we don't actually get this disarmed because I'm doing my goodness to say um, disar I'm d disarmed to defend it here my friends up on the up on the hill and he's not even seeing anyone either and it was a pretty pretty quick game as you can see and I thought I'd share it with you because one wanted a quick video, two I thought it was quite good game because of how quick it was and I'm not sure whether players in Battlefield are getting worse or whether just I'm getting slightly better or the teams I'm getting in are slightly better seeing as I put a video out a couple of months ago about Battlefield giving me the worst teams in the history of Battlefield and that does still happen but then every now and then I get put in a decent team or even a mediocre team like the one we're playing in now and you get put up against people who are at Absolutely appalling. And right here, shouldn't I have got this kill? I mean, the MP7 has a good rate of fire, and I think it does, I think, like 20 points of damage. And I'm pretty sure I got like 4 or 5 or 5 or 6 hit markers on there, so that should have been a kill. But I mean, I suppose there's no complaining about that there. I didn't die. And I do run up here to A and get the bomb without even being like contested one bit. I didn't even have to kill anyone on the way up. There's no one to my left, to my right. I need to check because there's nobody there. I know there's not. So I just pop in here get the arm. Normally, this is quite a strenuous thing to do. I have to try and dodge your way and did you see it? Just bringing that all the way up the stairs. I thought that was brilliant. I've never really seen anyone do that before, but finally, see two people here. Get my kill. Taken away from me there, sadly. And just, yeah, pop that guy in the head because that's how I roll. He can eat some bullets there, my friend. But, what I wanted to tell, talk to you about today was, well, it's a little bit late, three minutes into the commentary, it's only a five minute video, but if you're still here, I wanted to tell you that I'm thinking of varying up my channel a little bit, not, obviously, I'm not going to stray too far away from Battlefield 3, that is my primary goal, or primary aim for this channel, and there's my only death of the game, they managed to get behind us for some, for some reason, they're not actually defending their objective, but, there, be, there you go. Shows their teamwork, but they managed to get behind us and kill us. But as I was saying, Battlefield 3 is the primary aim of this channel. But I did want to stray away from it a little bit. I'm hopefully getting a new computer sometime soon, so I expect to see some new games, some new videos. Video games, or game videos on those games, or however you want to put it. And there goes my dog in the background, so... Yeah, I'll, I'll just leave her in the room, whatever, she might want to come out. But as I was going to say, I'm hopefully getting a new computer, so I'm looking into getting Medal of Honor Warfighter, which does look like a really good game so look forward to some of those videos in the not too distant future I'm also thinking about getting I'm getting into Daisy or Warzy when they come out because I know they're quite popular on YouTube not because I want to jump on the bandwagon but they are quite fun games to play so I was thinking about doing a playthrough of those maybe chucking up any other game I'm playing because as probably other people playing Battlefield would agree Battlefield 3 is getting a little bit a little bit stale as you saw there the MP7 has an absolutely disgusting hit fire it is absolutely wonderful but as I was saying Battlefield 3 does seem to be getting a little bit stale not just for me but for a few other people in the community it's been mentioned quite a lot seeing as I wasn't entirely impressed with Armored Kill Close Quarter doesn't really seem to be around that much and I don't know Battlefield just doesn't seem to be as exciting as it used to be don't 
don't like take that the wrong way. I absolutely love this game. I'm going to continue posting, but I was thinking about maybe varying up my content a little bit more and just posting some other games, other games that I'm playing and games that I'm just enjoying at the moment. So, let's play when I get my new computer, Medal of Honor Warfighter, because obviously that's published by A. He's using the Frostbite engine, and that's something I want to get into. So, this has basically been one of the quickest games I've ever played Rush on Battlefield 3. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. And I will leave you with some awesome music that is by the Sheepish Wolves again. So I hope you guys enjoy, and I will see you next time.